Software is the lingua franca of the information age. It vastly improves our ability to gather, store, understand, communicate, and act on information. Software has a special magic. It's a creation of the imagination, like music or poetry, yet it commands machinery and unlocks the secrets of data. For a young person, the ability to create software is empowering indeed. It promises a limitless future. These are scenes from the finals of the annual ACM International Collegiate Programming Contest. More than 100 three-person teams from around the world compete to be recognized as the world's top student coders. They got here by being the best among more than 25,000 participants from more than 2,000 universities who competed in regional contests worldwide. These finalists are the best of the best. So I, I started programming in fifth or sixth grade on, on a graphing calculator. At that time, I was playing lots of games, and I wanted to be able to make my own games. And the easiest way to uh, do this was the uh, programming was the, the programmable calculator that I got in my uh, math class. So I started writing games for it, and that was fun. But eventually, I kind of realized I was having more fun programming it than making games. I first time I mean software just uh, in, uh, when, I, when I was in high, high school. At school, at first, uh, I made a robot. When I made a robot, it's a cream. Uh, it's, it can make a cream, uh, cream cake. Yes. So doesn't matter if I'm from Colombia or any country in the world. I can attack those type of problems with, I don't know, just a computer and, and nothing else. I can be at my place. I can be at my office. I can be at my university. I can be with my friends and can help build another world. Can help build a better world. I think the, the technology will help Egypt in, in almost all fields. For example, the, the easiest example is the election. So it will be easier for everyone to, to make the election. Maybe it will take some time to, to, to be able to do it everywhere. I just graduated from the University of Virginia in May and I will be going to Johns Hopkins University Applied Physics Lab uh, starting in August to work on the Solar Probe Plus that will be launching in 2018 and I will be working on the embedded computer system as part of their space department there. Software isn't about where you are, but it's about what you can do. Whether you're a software engineer in Silicon Valley or in Beijing, the only thing that matters is the skills, the creativity, the productivity that you have. The annual programming contest challenges the teams to try to solve a set of complex problems in a span of just five hours. The teammates gather around a single computer and select which problems they'll take on first, divide up the tasks, design their solutions, and write software programs that solve the problems. The team that solves the most problems with the fewest errors is the winner. The message is clear. The future is bright for software programmers, especially the best of the best. The potential for these young programmers is incredible. They're going to spend their careers as engineers or as scientists solving hard, interesting problems every day. And they're going to have the satisfaction of seeing what they do make the world a better place.